there and screw off that last row. Oh, that's exactly what we wanted. Nice solid silicone seal all the way down. So if you've been watching my videos, you know we started this a while back. The addition that ties my shop in to the Connex. But we're turning the corner right now, guys, and we're getting ready to start out here on the front porch. And the biggest challenge we have right now is our front door. You can see here this door hangs on a track and it rolls on wheels and they could wear out. So we want to be able to replace this whole system if we have to without replacing this roof or taking the roof off. So I've come up with a way here that we can hang a beam across from this truss to that post. And then we can hang our rafter in the center from that beam down. Let's get it done. We're gonna need this hanger, this one, and this one. Each of these has a specific place that it's going. We'll take time right now to get these set. Web filler. But before we can set that one, we gotta fill the web. Right up there. Right there, we've got our rafters out here. We're gonna get the rafters cut real quick. Thank you. 
Now we can hang our next rafter from this beam down to our plate line. We're gonna need that. need to service that door, we're going to have room right in here. Alright guys, so now we can start running our purlins in there. We'll get a piece of fascia out here on the front. guys so thanks for watching man come back next time we're gonna take a break from this roof and I'll show you how we're making these coming soon to a city park near you in Colorado Springs Colorado we'll see you next time <laughs>